Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Curtis McElroy, joined by the amazing Vinny. That's right. Thank you, Curtis. Here again for uh, another exciting week of Overkill. That's right. From what I understand tonight, we've got a uh, quite quite the lineup in my. Am I correct in understanding that? We do, that? buddy. This is this is one of our biggest episodes of Overkill ever. This is, you know, pay-per-view level show here that we're giving on a normal episode of Overkill because um, this is a special episode of Overkill. This is our final Overkill. Right, Coy. We are, as always, in the beautiful Hammerstein Ballroom here in New York City. It might be the last time we're here, but I'm glad that we were here for all the weeks. It's been a great time here. And yes. let's... Let's break down this amazing card we have for our, our viewing audience. We have an awesome eight-man battle royal with some great characters that we will explain a little more about a little bit later. We have a lucha tag between El Ciclope and Psicopata versus the Luchadores de Murica, Colt Nelson and Colonel Clemens. Very interesting. Very interesting, but should be a very good lucha match, I believe. You wouldn't I'm expect it by up. looking at, you know, Colt Nelson and Colonel Clemens, but they are very <laughs> talented luchadors. Yeah, one hand for that matchup definitely does not, uh, not what I would imagine when you that, told me if they were luchadors. That is fair. Then we have the team. A team, ah, man. Nope, you know, I'm, I'm just, I'm just so, I'm so taken by by emotion because this is our last overkill. Um, I, I got a little flustered there. Point. We have yeah, the outlaw. Isaiah James taking on the skate punk himself, Greg Thomas, in a singles match. Not a tag match, just, just, just so you know. Just, yep. well, I just need to correct myself. I'm sorry. One-on-one. Yeah, one-on-one -on -one match. It should be a really fun, hard-hitting match. I'm really looking forward to that one. Is it my? Then we have a four-way elimination match between Carnero de la Muerte, Violento, El Sonico, and CJ Glory. You may see, you may see that match and say, "Whoa, what's CJ Glory doing in this lucha match?" But CJ Glory is actually quite proficient in lucha libre, so this he will not be that outmatched in that match. Should be a fun one that one. In a rematch, I believe of our first show we ever had, we Goodness have gracious. Yes, we have the team of the Gods of Death, Death and Anubis, going up against Joe and the Ape, Joe and Ape Boy. Excellent. Those are two I'm fan favorite tag one. teams we have here. What a way to wait a way to end this uh, end this program. Man. That is true. End it with some of our funnest characters squaring off once again. Agreed. Then we have a uh, three way of three of our most technically proficient wrestlers. We have Tech, Josh Bradley, and the British Dragon Simon Buckley squaring off in a three way elimination match there. That should be a really, really solid match, I believe. I think so, too. I think so, too. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Oh, this is, this is one right here. We have the Macho Meat Man of Macho Man's Ghost and Ribby taking on the Dynamite Brothers, David and Elias Dynamite. You know, these, these are two teams that have both, you know, been very close to that, you know, top upper echelon of our tag team division here. And, you know, they're going to be squaring off tonight to see who's the best of them. And I'm, I'm yes, excited. Oh, speaking of oh, another rematch goodness. from our first show, we have Rick Anderson taking on Joey Muscles. Uh, Joey Muscles was the first of, you know, little Rick Anderson, first opponent in Rick Anderson's little, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Crusade, I guess, against all our fun yeah. characters. You know, Rick Anderson, he's a, yeah, he's a old school traditional wrestler and he, you know, doesn't like the flashy weird characters, but you know, Joey Muscles was not an easy win for Rick Anderson that first night. Joey Muscles showed a lot of fire, came into that match as a kind of a jerk, and came out a fan favorite. I I am very much looking forward to the rematch here. And in mind, my friend. Ooh. Oh, my goodness. This was a match we actually, last week, promised you would be our main event. But, you know, plans change. Uh, this is uh, Frank the Butcher and Chuckles the Clown, our tag team champions, going up against Max Seva and Christopher Fireheart for those tag titles. A little backstory there. Uh, Christopher Fireheart and Max Seva were supposed to be in the tag title tournament and were actually brutally attacked by Frank the Butcher and Chuckles the Clown. And then Ch they Frank, Frank and Chuckles, they made it the way to the finals of that tournament and won. So 
this is a big match here. Seven Fire Truck finally need to prove what they what they wanted to prove from day one that they deserve to be those tag champs. We will see if that's the case. And then in our main event, we have. I'll be honest, I don't, I'm not a big fan of the man. He's a little creepy to me, but I can't deny his amazing talent. That's Travis Bateman, who is going up against Big Daddy, Zach Harris. And that'll be for our Global Heavyweight Championship. Our main event, our final main event, the main event of downtown Kentucky Pro Wrestling, in a sense. And, you know, I'm excited about that one. Should be a really good one. And I'm, I gotta be honest with you, Kurt, I'm hoping that uh, Zach here takes home that big belt. Big Daddy taking home the big belt. I can understand that. I'll be honest, my heart might be in the same place. We'll have to wait and see what happens, though. Yes, we will. Let's get this started. Let's get the show to the way. We're, we're starting off hot with an eight-man battle royal. Yes, indeed we are. In this battle royal, we have uh, Tommy Flood Blade. Blake, sorry. I don't, they're, they're brothers. I get them confused sometimes. Right, right, right. Yeah. Easy to. Yeah, we have Tom. We're going left to right for new viewers, if you're tuning in for our last show ever. Um, I'm sorry that you're tuning in for the last show ever. <laughs> but, yeah, nonetheless, we have Tommy Flood, Blake, Lee Vincent, Van Bradley, Blade, Scotty Flash, O'Shawn, and Infierno. Yeah, uh, that surely this it will be a wild match for the. It age. will be for sure. I am excited about this one. This will be a fun battle royal. So my my friend, he's in my. This surely will be an action pick battle royal. Oh, uh, it's a lot of action trying to figure out what's going on here. It looks like uh, Blake Blake is squaring off with Van Bradley right now. Yeah, it appears that way. Um, we also have Blade taking on Scotty Flash over in, on the other side. Infierno, sharing in the corner. Questionable decision. With the amount of talent in this ring, I would not be taking time away from looking at them. Oh, that. Big hurricane runner from Van Bradley to Infierno. <laughs> Oh, big gut buster from Blake to yeah, Scotty. Tommy Flood? Tommy Flood, yes. <laughs> My, yeah. Oh, we have our first elimination. Our Scotty first Flash. elimination. Scotty Flash has been eliminated. I did not catch who it was by, but Scotty Flash is out of the match. Wild. Absolutely wild. Van Bradley takes a knee from Blade. Looks like Blade is going after Blake, his own brother. Some and Blake says, no, I am not having any of that, my friend. little brotherly rivalry right there. Oh. What's we got? What do we got here? Oh, it's, uh, oh, looks like uh, Van went for a drop, but missed on Lee Vincent. Oh. Oh. Blake looks like delivering oh. a brutal... Looks F like Tommy right Flood back. might be Flood's about head. to be eliminated by Inferno. No, no, he saves himself. Wow. Uh-oh. O'Shawn taking the oh. heat off the of plate. Van Bradley with a big elbow in the corner to Lee Vincent. Goes to the top rope. Questionable about a roll, but... Oh, big senton on to Lee Vincent. O'Shawn with a big rolling elbow to Blade. Blake and comes in like to Blake help says, his brother. I don't need your help. <laughs> Oh, it looks like Van Bradley is trying to eliminate Lee Vincent. But no, was not able to. Lee Vincent able to roll back into the ring. Big moonsault to no one uh, by no, Blake. absolutely nobody. Questionable decision there. Maybe he's just showing off. I'm not quite sure what he's going for there. Questionable at best. Yes. Looks like Van is once again trying to eliminate. And he does eliminate Lee Vincent this time. Lee Vincent out of the match. Oh, big crossbody to Van Bradley from Blake. Big alley oop from uh, Tommy Flood to Infierno. Uh oh. Infierno has been eliminated by top by Van Bradley. Van throws O'Shawn into Blade, and he's whipping him back into Blade once again, making them run into each other. 
Looks like he is now trying to eliminate Oshan. Oh my goodness. But no, he does not. Oshan fights back. Big rolling elbow. And Tommy Flood. Fire right. carry takeover by Ben Bradley to Oshan. So like he's going to try to eliminate. Oh, drop kick to the back. Do not think Oshan saw that one coming. Van Bradley goes. Oh, gets tilt to backbreaker by Blake to Van Bradley. Oshan has been eliminated by Tommy oh Flood. Oh my goodness. We're down to our final four here. Half the, ma the men in this match have been eliminated. We are left with Tommy Flood, Van Bradley, Blade, and Blake. Looks like uh, Blake is trying to eliminate Van Bra uh, Blade. My bad. So much going on here, it's hard to keep track of what's happening. Yes, indeed it is. Looks like Tommy Flood is trying to eliminate Van Bradley, but he is fighting out of it. Oof. Oh, big running single leg dropkick from Van Bradley to Tommy Flood. What? Oh, big, big elbow one. drop from Blake to, elbow his part, drop. to his own brother, Blake. This is brotherly rivalry here. Oh, takedown by Blake. Oh, gut buster, my bad. Looks like he's going for a takedown, but it turned into a gut buster. Hurricane Rana from Van Bradley. Some crazy action in this one. Goodness. Do not, do not remember uh, Blake wearing that undershirt before today. That's I don't know what's going on there. No do I. <laughs> Very interesting. All right. Just noticed that and got caught real off guard by it. Big knee strike from Blade oh. to Blake. Yes, indeed. He is not having it. And neither is Blake. Oh, big hurt around from Van Bradley to Blake. Whips off Blade into the corner. Oh, it looks like Van Bradley might have... Oh. Uh oh A boot from Blade. Delivers an elbow right back into him. Oh, elbow from Blade. From Blade to Van Bradley. Oh, big tombstone coming from Blade to Van Bradley. Goodness. But wait. Russian leg sweep from Blake to his brother Blade. Looks like he's calling for him to get up. What will we see here? It's... Uh-oh. Uh, ooh! Big Powerball backbreaker there. Oh! Big gut deadlift into a suplex there from Blake to Van Bradley. Followed up by a big crossbody to his brother Blade. Is this what I think we're seeing here? It looks like oh. Blake is showing a lot of fire here tonight. He certainly is. Fire that I don't know we've seen from him in the history of uh, downtown Kentucky pro wrestling yet. Ooh, oh my goodness! Big pop up drop kick there from Van Bradley. Absolutely wild. Looks like he's trying to throw out Blade. And he gets him out. We're down to our final two of Blake and Van Bradley. Neither man hits what they were going for there. Big Hurricane Rana. Rana, there it is. Oh, it looks like he was going for something there. But oh, caught into a T-bone suplex. Brutal. Oh, goodness. What could he be going for here? Oh, reverse into a fireman's carry from Van Bradley. Big running single leg drop kick. Oof. Looks like he's trying to throw him out. Oh, and he throws him right out there of the is. match. The winner, Van Bradley. Impressive performance from Van Bradley tonight. But you see in these replay, replay packages a lot of Blake, because Blake was very impressive in that match. No greed.
Yeah, we definitely had our, our two shining stars last the end of the round. Here. There was a show next week. I'd be looking forward to see what Blake was doing. Sadly, there's not. Oh, unfortunately not. But you know what? We do have a show tonight. So I'm excited about what our next match is. I believe it is our Lucha Tag Match. Whoa, what's this? This wasn't the match that I was told was next. No, oh, well, yeah. uh, change, plans yeah, change. Gonna change. <laughs> plans change. Um, our next match is actually Josh Bradley versus Tech versus the British Dragon, Simon Buckley. I am All very right, excited yeah. about this one. This should be a good one. I thought we were going to have Lucha Tag, but, you know, plans change, as we said, you know, but, uh, you know, I'm okay with these plans changing, because this match should be a really fun match. Hey, you just gotta roll with the punches, and the elbows, <laughs> and the flying, and the rolling capo kicks, like our main event. Oh, big flying nothing from Josh Bradley. Hey, speaking of a big old knee, Simon Buckley delivering exactly that to Josh Bradley. Well, Oh, uh oh, rolling elbow into a German. <laughs> it looks like Tech and Josh said, how dare you? Josh taking a it. Techno now. Oh, super kick to the knee, followed by a super kick to the face. This match is yeah, elimination, that. so that, we will get to, we will, basic, I don't know what I'm trying to say. Just, it's elimination. <laughs> this might be a, a pretty long match based on exactly that. Yes, yes it might. Fireman's carry takeover by Josh Bradley to Tech. Simon Buckley picks up Josh Bradley and hits him with a suplex. Big running elbow to Tech. Diamond cutter. Oh, oh follow by Larry. Josh Bradley throws him out of the ring, goes for the pin on Tech. He thinks that cutter was enough. Wow. Oh my. And it is. What? And Tech. I'm baffled. You're just out of the round. I am absolutely baffled. I'm wondering if Tech got rocked with that one or something. I don't know. That's He must have. Like, no offense uh, to Simon Buckley. That was a good move, but that's not a move he normally wins with. I was not like, seeing that coming. Yeah, nor was I. Nor I, was I actually, honestly, I hope we get a medical update on Tech. I'm a little worried for him. Oh. Missed that drop kick. Went for that diamond cutter again. Missed that. There's that big jumping drop kick. Up to the top rope goes Josh Bradley. Goes for a big flying senton, but Simon Buckley was able to get his knees up. Just in time from the looks of it. Big European oh. uppercut. Oh. Kick to the oh. gut. Oh, another kick to the gut. Looks like he's going for, oh, a running knee. Boom. And there it is. Oh, one, one count, count. that. Running code breaker. Josh Bradley going up to the top rope. Could be going for oh, went for a, an axe handle, but was reversed by Simon Buckley. Oh, drop toe hold by oh. Simon Buckley to Josh Bradley. Back and forth reversals here. Looks like Josh Bradley. Might have no more reversals. Oh. Simon Buckley with a knee to the head. Oh, sling blade. Looks like he's going for the chicken wing gut buster oh. there. Ooh, that is brutal. Looks like he's telling him to get up. I believe he's going for the package battle driver here. He certainly is. It looks like he just might get it. Dropped him right oh, on his head. Goodness. That is, Josh Bradley might be out on that one. And Simon Buckley certainly thinks but so. But no! Oh my! The fire! Oh, the knee strike from Simon Buckley. Simon Buckley is not, is trying to put out that fire. He certainly is. And boy, he just might. <laughs> oh my goodness. Back and forth action here. Big clothesline to the floor. Simon showing off. Superhero landing there. So he's going to the top rope. Oh! Did not catch it. Not at all. Oh, tries to catch him on the way in. Drop down. Leapfrog. Leapfrog. 
went for the running clothesline, but instead took a hot shot from Simon. Simon picking him up, measuring him. Oh! Oh! Looks like he might have busted him open on that elbow above the eye. I can't tell. I think you just might be right, Coit. Tell you what, I certainly would not want to be on the receiving end of any of Josh Bradley's elbows. Well, Josh, oh, Josh going for Oh, that's the Brody knee. That is typically the setup to his finisher. We'll have to wait to see if we can see it tonight. The pile driver. And he there hits it. Is, it. Folks. That might be all she wrote. Oh, but no, Simon Buckley. So much resiliency kicking out of that move. Picks him up. Goes for something, oh. but Josh Bradley saw it coming. Oh, super kick to the knee, followed by the oh. super kick to the face. What is he going for? I don't. Josh Bradley, I guess, rethought whatever he was planning there. Big takedown oh. there. A big takedown indeed. Josh Bradley up to the top rope. So he's going for the moonsault, but oh, Simon In Buckley! To Simon Buckley's knees. Simon Buckley is scouting all these high-risk moves, and with his knees, he is ready for him. Went for a knee strike there, but missed. Oh, but caught his kick into a power bomb. Oh, oh big running drop kick from Josh Bradley. Josh Bradley trying to get the fans pumped up for something. Oh, that was to the side of the head. Certainly was. Oh, cameraman. Oh! Just big corkscrew crossbody. Josh Bradley picking him up. Looks like he's going for... Oh! A chair, perhaps? No, wait. He, he thinks better of it. Probably for the better. You hate oh, to lose. went for a big crossbody, but missed. On a disqualification on this. That is true. You would hate to see that happen on a show like this. One of our last shows, you hit see any matches, you have to be thrown out by disqualification. That would certainly be unfortunate. It would be. Uh oh. Ooh. Reversal there. Throws Josh over the top rope. Looks like he's trying to bring him back in with a suplex here. And Ooh, there it is. Almost hit the ref. That looks like he's going over the top rope for that, I believe, his double stomp. You are right, my friend. But wait, oh, Josh is getting up. So oh! Simon Buckley able to pivot his mindset there and switch to an elbow drop. Arm drag. Drop, single leg drop kick. Josh going to the top rope again. Have to wonder if it's a good, good idea, but it was not. And it turns out to not be. Simon Buckley got those not knees up all. once again. Simon Buckley has those high risk moves scouted. Went for a big super kick, it looked like. Oh, Sling Blade! Going for that double stomp. We will see if he yeah, hits it. There it is. Oh, but no, he does Josh not. Bradley also had it scouted. Oh, what's this? Gut Wrench. Power Bomb. And that just might be all she wrote. No! Oh, not even close. Simon Buckley still has fight left in him. Oh! Big running elbow there. Oh, kicks off Josh. Oh, back and forth. Or back and forth. We are certainly getting this, the match. Ma this the match right here. here. Oh. Uh oh. Oh, the double super kick spot. That could be all she wrote. That very well could luckily. be. He's telling him to get up, telling him he's ready to spin him around. And oh, ooh, neck breaker into a, another neck breaker, double neck breaker there. That was a crazy move. Oh, picks him up, but oh, Simon Buckley able to reverse out of it. Went for the wrong elbow. Simon Buckley just shrugged it off. European uppercut. 
rolling elbow from Josh Bradley. Oh, drop kick to the oh knee. My goodness. He could be dissecting him at this point. What's he gonna go for here? Oh, reversed out by Simon Buckley. Working over that arm. Ooh, elbow to the elbow. Oh, elbow to the face. Not really sure what happened there. <laughs> Josh continuing to go for that uh, spinning heel kick, I believe it is. But he's not able to catch it. Oh, misses it again. Might be time to rethink that move. It just might be. But he really is determined to hit that move today. Just a kick to the face. A big kick to the face at that. Don't know what oh. he's going for quite there, but did not get it. Oh, picks him up for that Brody knee. And he thinks and that might be enough. I don't know but about no, that. No, it's not. Oh my. Simon Buckley says, I definitely know about that. It is it is not going to be enough. Josh telling him to get up. Oh, big rock bottom. And that just might do it, folks. What? That no. Just might do it. He's going for another one of those high risk moves. Was having worked out tonight. And they he, certainly he's really are not determined. Now. He is really determined to hit him. Oh, Josh, reverse DT out of that fireman's carry. Death Valley driver. I must presume from Simon Buckley. Oh, and it's not looking good for for Simon Buckley here. Drop down, leapfrog. Big running forearm. Oh. Oh, there's that spinning heel kick you've been going for for a while. There it is. Looks like, oh, he went up to the top rope. Went for a flying accident, but missed. Oh, sling bite on the floor. I'll tell you, if you get up, looks like he might be going for a package pile driver on the floor. Oh my goodness, folks. But no! Josh Bradley saw it coming. Aaron Lee. Josh Bradley, once again. Oh no! Goes for another moonsault. Hits it this oh, time. Oh, he hits it. Oh, wait, can he, he might be going for the pile driver on the, on the chair, but no. Simon Buckley reverses out of it. For the sake of Simon Buckley's neck, I'm glad he did. Uh -oh. oh, wait. Can we see the package pile driver on the chair? No, they just narrowly oh, missed it, quite. thankfully. Yeah, thankfully for Josh. Oh, my gosh, he's picking Josh back up. Oh, oh no. My. Oh, goodness. This time Is it might be. No, it looks Not like he did quite. miss it again, thankfully. But oh my gosh, Josh Bradley seems stiff there. I like he's think not that's gonna be well. a rope break. No. But no. Wow. That that is all that is all she wrote. Simon Buckley with a big win there. Absolutely wild, folks. That Absolutely was that wild. was crazy. That one. You know the folks from across the pond showing us that they can indeed. They are. Bring that was an British impressive. dragon showing off what he can do tonight. Yeah. Uh, I, I can't, I, as great as that match was, I really do wish we could have saw more of Tech in it, but, you know, it was still amazing what Josh Bradley and Simon Buckley were able to show us tonight. That's right. That's right. I, I do hope we get an update on Tech before the end of the show. I hope he is doing all right. But, no, you know, right. the show has to move on, um, and our next match is Psicopata and El Ciclope going up against Los Luchadores de Murica. Colt Nelson and Colonel Clemens. That's right. On, on paper, you might hear those names and think that we're about to see something completely different than we're going to see because we are about to see a amazing, potential classic Lucha, Lucha Libre match. Both these Nancy teams Davis very well versed well. in Lucha. Indeed. Oh, 
Oh, oh big drop kick from Colt to Sikopata. Yeah, they starting it off hot. Uh-oh. Oh, elbow to the knee. Big in Zaguri. Tags out to Ciclope. Oh, Ciclope with a oh. running kick there. Did oh. not get quite enough distance to hit what he was going for there. But in very traditional lucha fashion, he went for it again. <laughs> yes, he did, and he, he lands it quite handily. Goes on the top rope. What could be going for here? Oh, what about a diving code breaker? But and Colt just kind of walks away casually from that. Looks like we might be going. Colt might be setting up for a monkey flip here. Oh, right into the ropes. Yeah, it can't feel too good. No. Oh, got the arm there. Looks like he is walking him over to do a. I believe he's going for a. Uh, Arm drag there. Oh, Ciclope rolling to the out, out of the ring, trying to get a little bit of reprieve, but may have been a mistake. Oh my! It was. It was indeed. That Goodness was crazy. gracious. But what, oh, Ciclope moved out of the way for whatever Cold Nelson was going for there. Just in time. Oh. Ciclope does a double diving oh. axe handle there. Is he going for it again? Oh, up on the top rope. Oh, my goodness. Oh, but oh, he was caught by Colt Nelson there. Oh, drop kicks him right into the ring apron. Brutal. Brutal, brutal, Absolutely brutal. brutal. Oh, runs him into the corner post. You know, I promised you a Lucha match, but Colt Nelson just kind of breaking it down here and just brawling with Ciclope. Oh, Ciclope. Ciclope seeming to be Ciclope struggling Ciclope just a little doing bit. a little dance there, but oh, Hurricane Rana. Oh. What's this? Oh, diving double stomp. Yeah, it looks like it took a lot out of Ciclope there. He is having trouble getting to his feet. Oh, Colt Nelson with a hurt run on the floor. Ciclope kips up. Gets back in the ring. Oh! Oh my! Oh my goodness! Don't know what happened there. Miscommunication between the Luchadores de America. Ciclope takes that advantage, that time to tag out to Ciclopata. Is Colt Nelson doing? Sikopato with a big Frankensteiner there. Oh, not even a one. Sikopato whips off Colt. Drop down. Leapfrog. Oh, arm ringer. Oh, elbow to the face. Pushes the drop kick out of the way. Goes for a spinning heel kick. Pushes the drop kick out of the way. Jumps up. Big Tornado DDT oh. springboard. Goodness gracious, folks. We got a match here. Oh, what he's going for here. Fun one to watch that. Oh! Don't know what he was going for quite there, but it does look like he might have caught him. And it does appear that, that he's picking it him did up. come at a cost. Just a wee bit of a cast. Oh! Whoa. Went for a belly to belly, it looks like. But blocked. Oh, drop kick! By Colt Nelson. What about that spinning heel kick? Rolls out of the ring. Oh. Let's let's Colt Nelson do a flip on to no one. Oh, Colt Nelson was able to tag out to Colonel Clemens there though. Tie up. Shoved by Colonel Clemens. Went for a kick. Missed it. Elbow. Another kick. Oh, what's he going for here? Oh. Throwing him to the floor. Looks like he might be setting what up a dive of some sort. Hits the ropes. Oh, goodness, folks. Oh, Tope con Gyro. Oh, he's just trying to attack Ciclope. So, uncalled for here. He's 
these Luchadors de America, you know, taking a lot of anger out on the more traditional Luchadors. They yeah, have indeed. You gotta wonder if maybe there's just some mis uh, miscommunication or uh, maybe I don't know. No, they're not quite quite on the same page as the uh, classic culture of the Luchadors. You know what I'm saying? Oh, it's probably running into the ring. Getting oh. the taste of his own medicine, attacking him when he's not the legal man. Oh! Oh! He just elbowed Sinkapata. Looks like, looks like he's leaving now. He's done what he wanted to do. Looks like he might be rethinking and might be coming back. If I was Sinkapata, I would not want to tag out to him now, though. Why oh, would I? But looks like Sinko Potter doesn't oh. think he has a choice. But oh, big elbow to the back from Colonel Clemens. Uh oh. Oh, big jumping heel kick. He's telling him to get up. Might be going for that spiking pedigree finish he has. I think he just might be right here. Oh. And he hits it. Spikes him head first. Right oh my! He kicked out at like one. Oh! The ref's been taken down. Wait, what's this? Oh my gosh, he sprayed it with mist! Wow. This wow, folks. That was that was brutal. I don't know what that's just uncalled for. You know, I like. Not surprised that he waited until the ref was down to do that. Tags in Ciclope. Ciclope goes for a drop kick, misses. He goes for another drop kick, misses. Punch to the kidneys. Oh, just slams him down. I think he's going up to the top rope. Telling Colonel Clemens to get out. Oh, goodness gracious. Just taunting. He decided to go for it. Oh, went for an elbow. Missed it. it. Looks like that taunting has come back to bite him in the butt. Oh, working over the arm here. Looks like he is going up top for uh Why am I brain blanking on that? That's a... An arm drag. That is an arm drag. Thank you, Vinny. You're welcome. <laughs> oh, you know, once I'm again. mostly here for color commentating. But occasionally, I know what I'm talking about. <laughs> oh man, my just I'm just so so sad with this being our last show that sometimes my emotions are getting the best of me today. Oh, nice Hurricane Rana from Colonel Clemens. Indeed, indeed. Oh, catches the spinning oh. soul kick. Does Ciclope? Ciclope. Oh, setting up for that Kudo driver, the Vertebraker. Many names you can call it, but no matter what. It's going to hurt your neck. Oh, and that it does. Oh, hits Col Colt Nelson. Looks like he's going for the pin on Colonel Clemens. Let's we'll see if that's enough. I think you just might be right, and it just might be. And it is. I've also heard that move. Uh, there was a wrestler by the name of Homicide who called that the Gringo Killer, and I think that might be what he was going for there. <laughs> and you know what? It certainly seems to have paid off for him. It did. There's that spiking pedigree. Don't know what we're getting a that weird choice for the replay package. Agree. Not, not, the, not the best footage uh, on the camera. There are your winners. Yeah. That's Sicopata and El Ciclope. Two of the best right here from Mexico. Wrestling here in downtown Kentucky Pro Wrestling. That's right. That's right. Ooh. <laughs> this is going to be a good one. This one right here, we have the outlaw, Isaiah James, taking on Greg Thomas. You know, Greg Thomas is one half of Skate or Die with Van Bradley, who got a big win earlier tonight. So, can Greg Thomas do the same? We will see. We will see. Is it Skate or Die's mm -hmm. night? Or is it the night of the outlaw? We will find out. One way or another. If the Outlaw is on a little bit of a winning streak, I believe. At least one of his last two matches. I could be mistaken. 
do know that oh. Greg, I do know that Greg Thomas did lose his last match, actually. Oh, just did a backflip for fun. Yes, that is right. true. Was it Zach Harris? I thought it was Rick Anderson, but you might be right. I don't remember. It was indeed, I, I believe, Zach Harris. It, it probably was. I genuinely don't remember. That's fair. Goodness gracious. Big Craig Thomas elbow. is absolutely brutalizing Isaiah James uh, here. He is. Craig Thomas just taking it to Isaiah. This is just like, I don't remember who we fought last week, but I do remember we went a lot like this. At the beginning, Greg seemed unstoppable, but eventually, you know, I don't know. Oh, don't know what he went for there. Maybe that's maybe that's the point where he's going to be stopped. He looks like he went for like a diving DDT, but on a downed opponent, it was a questionable decision for sure. Mm -hmm. Like a very questionable, very questionable because I don't believe that move is possible. Now they're just showing off Isaiah James there with these backflips. Went for a big drop kick, misses. Oh, fights out of whatever Greg was going for there. Oh, captures the leg into a German. Into a suplex. There it is. Looks like he might be, I don't know what he's going for here. Oh, but Isaiah's fighting out of it. Isaiah's showing a lot of fire here tonight. Oh, big clothesline oh. in the corner. Isaiah on the, on the apron. Even none of that. To go for springboard frog splash, but misses. Went for a drop kick, did Greg. But Isaiah was able to move out of the way. Go for that moonsault again. Oh, clothesline. Did not look like he cut all of it, but he cut enough of it. And he certainly did. Oh, big jawbreaker. Oh, oh! He cut all of that one. That's for sure. Oh, big oh. That rocker dropper! Oh, whips him off. Drop down. Leapfrog. Went for the drop kick, but it was caught. Ooh, Ooh. kick to the gut. Picks him up. Does Greg Thomas? Looks like he was going for a belly oh. belly, but reversed with an elbow by Isaiah. Big drop kick. Don't know what that was, but he took out the ref. ref. I don't know if that was intentional. What's this? Oh, he's going for that pump handle slam. Ooh, and big, he gets yeah, it. Big pump handle power slam. Looks like he might be going over that top rope again. What could it be for? Goes for that uh, spiral tap. Hits it this time. Didn't take out the ref this time. Yeah. <laughs> Went for a big jumping in Zaguri. Oh, big for a big rolling clothesline. What's this? Oh, torture rack. Spun uh -oh. out into a power bomb. Kicks him. Looked a little low. It did look a little low. Yeah. Setting up looks like a, a Muda lock. Oh. Nadal, they're in the ropes. Good officiating there by the referee. Oh. Irish whip back out of the ring. But no. Frank Thomas fights out of it. Goes for a slingshot something, but it got caught by the outlaw. What a back and forth match we have here. It is very back and forth. Yes, it is. Oh, big shoulder oh. tackle. Oh, shooting the gun at him. He is an outlaw. Oh, decided not to jump out on him. Guess just playing some mind games. Wait, no! Does hit a suicide dive. There's the suicide dive. Going over the top rope. It's like he's measuring him for something, waiting for him to get up, maybe. Big oh, goodness. diving axe handle. Oh, going over that top rope again. 
what could be going for here? These high risk maneuvers have been paying off. What's it going for? Oh, with a big flying leg drop onto the floor, but misses. That has to hurt your tailbone. That's a long fall onto onto your backside. Oh. Chokes oh my him on God. the floor. Oh, thank you, uh, Jackson16283 for following. And it's very appreciated. Welcome to the very final match. Well, not final match, final show. You. Final show. Yeah, final show. You're right. We have multiple matches still to come tonight. That's, that's my quick. This oh, right now is the outlaw Isaiah James taking on Greg Thomas. Greg Thomas the, is the man in the shorts. Isaiah James is the cowboy in the cowboy boots with his name on his butt. No, hold on. I know, it's crazy. You might have thought that was Greg. I definitely thought that was Greg. You sure that's not Blade making a second appearance? Blade? I said Greg. <laughs> <laughs> I was just teasing you, your, your confusion. Ah. Oh, what's the. Oh, went for that spinning powerbomb, but was reversed. Uh oh. Oh, oh, chopping him down there. Just for a big, I believe, running. Oh my! That, I would have thought it could have knocked him out with how brutal that was. Uh, I am doing quite fine. Thank you for asking, Jackson. And doing all right, too. I got a little bit of a headache because of allergies, I do believe, but uh, I'll, I'll, be, I'll be okay. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, great job. Oh Thomas my goodness. With the win with that choke slam. Yeah, uh, you gotta you gotta imagine that uh, part of that was due to uh, that that choke slam that he landed on the concrete that is outside true. of the ring, and that missed diving leg drop. A that lot really of crazy had to stuff take it here. out of the outlaws. Yeah, that is true. Here's our replay. And there's great. There's our winner. Thomas. Yeah, our winner, Greg Thomas. There he is. Let him go. Let's move on to our next match. Oh, our big four-way lucha style match. We have um, CJ Glory on the left. We'll go left to right. We have CJ Glory, Violento, Carnero de la Muerte, and El Sonico. This should be a fun right. one here. You may think, hey, three of these guys look like luchadors. Well, well, two of them definitely do. And with a name like El Sonico, you may assume. One but, would assume. But CJ Glory is no slouch when it comes to the Lucha Libre. Oh, absolutely not. He may not wear a mask, but uh, he certainly has some high-flying moves, despite his size. That is true. He does a lot of Lucha moves. Oh, what's this? Speaking of, despite his size doing Lucha, there's a tilt Violento tries to eliminate CJ Glory quickly here. He certainly does. Carnero loops off El Sonico. Drop down, leapfrog. Oh, and just kicks oh. out his leg. Carnero thinks that's enough, but I doubt it. I'm surprised and he even got one. El Sonico says no. Oh, El Sonico fighting up. Uh, oh, not... cameraman making questionable camera choices here. We... And Carnero. Doing something on yeah, to absolutely is. nobody. Uh, to answer to answer your question, Jackson. Um, yeah, personally, I play 2K19, but I don't actually have it on PC, so we do not stream it. Oh goodness! I cannot see this cameraman. You know, if it wasn't for the fact that this is our last show, I'd still say he deserves to be fired. Oh, absolutely! And you know what? He's been in I certainly hope He's that he does not find work since day after one. Oh, catches a big power bomb from Carnero del Sonico, I believe. I can't see it, so I'm not 100 percent sure. Hey, Cameron Good gosh. Is really throwing this entire match right to heck. Looks like Carnero is deciding to leave the ring. Oh, Sonico is delivering a big uh, jump kick to heck. Or did you drop pick rated? Uh, oh, attack. I would like to once also thank the Savior nine one two one for following us as well. Thank you. Oh, big total head scissors. 
Well, they're out here really, they're out here really trying to make us regret stopping doing wrestling games. That's right. Three follows in one day. That's a big deal. Thank you very much for Thank everyone who's followed. Hello, the savior. Oh, and hello, Kier2008, who also followed. Oh my goodness. What's up, guys? How's it going? Uh, yeah. Yeah, give hell yeah. <laughs> I'll give you a hell yeah. <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, this game right. sucks, Jackson. That's what the heck is this camera angle. That is simply the only answer, and that's part of why it is the only wrestling game I own on PC, and that's part of why this is the last stream, is because this game is broken. And we're yeah, tired of playing. If you like uh, watching two guys play co-op games, uh, tune in to our Tuesday stream. Yes. On Tuesday and possibly and Thursday. next Thursday. And next, starting next Thursday, we'll be doing co-op, just like general co-op gaming on Tuesday, Thursdays as well. This is the last time we're playing wrestling, but I do hope you guys, you know, stick around in future weeks some of those other videos. Uh, I know. Don't, that's fair as well. Yeah, no, it's on. I don't have a capture card, though, so I only can play games on stream on PC. Oh, goodness. CJ taking it to Violento. And now to El Sonico. So Carnero is picking up Violento. Big power slam. Violento hey. rolls out of the ring. Goes for a dropkick to CJ Glory. CJ Glory just decides not to even acknowledge it. Tilt a whirl. Not. Head scissors by Carnero. Violento looks like he's going for that European uppercut to the back of the head. I do not play Fortnite. Oh, nor do I. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, buddy. Yeah. Not not my scene. Not really big into shooters in general, honestly. Oh! CJ Glory! I need to Catch eliminate Violento because he has kick. that weird glitchy thing. Oh, no way, he's hitting me with it, so we're fine. <laughs> uh, my favorite WWE superstar would probably be uh, AJ Styles. And Chris doesn't really watch wrestling, so. I sure don't. <laughs> so pick one of the random names you know from the past. Come on, Chris. <laughs> I'm gonna have to go with the. Uh, oh, jeez. Uh, Rey Mysterio. I don't there know. There you go. All right. That's a fair answer. <laughs> no one will question Or, that. you know, Macho Man, because of course. That's true. Macho Man is great. I do have a soft spot for Macho Man, mainly because his voice is just ridiculous. <laughs> CJ Glory taking it to. Uh... El uh, Carnero. Oh, uh, goodness. Carnero throws CJ Glory into the ring. I do not play Mortal Kombat. I like Mortal Kombat. I just don't own it at all, currently. Mortal Kombat's fun. It is fun. I like fighting games, but I can only play them for so long. Yeah, that's fair. I, Brock Lesnar's cool. I mean, I think there was a period of time where he was, um, it was a little too much. Uh, you know, that, that year where he was champion was there like five times. But in general, oh, El Sonico has been eliminated by Violento. And it looks like Carnero might be about to be eliminated by CJ Glory. It sure looks that way. Ah, uh, chat, you're distracting us. <laughs> yeah, actually, my uh, Parsec just decided to stop working. Oh, is that what happened? No, it makes yeah. sense. Yeah. I didn't even know I was pinned for a second. Oh, now Anywho, back to commentary. Yeah, right? commentary. Oh, 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 yes. <laughs> because now I have nothing else to do. <laughs> and until the chat asks a question, then I have to answer that. You know, That's yeah. more important than our silly gameplay. <laughs> oh, Kier left and then came back. Because now they're, instead of the green, they are red. Oh, weird. Which is making reading chat very, very hard. Yeah, now we've no. got Jackson and Kier. With the yeah, no, that is a color. weird choice that the game decided to do there. Oh, Carnero. Oh, hey. Speaking of weird things, that uh, good old comeback. Yeah, yeah, no, it's great. I love, I love when the comeback breaks. I'll break character for a little bit here. I'll complain about the stupid game. There's and you reason... know what? That's what you gotta love about the game. That's, that's the reason we're stopping this gameplay series, is because it's such a broken mess. There has been numerous times where we've just had to restart recordings because the game decided that it Including didn't want to work. Including today, we had to restart the thing. Yeah. Almost twice. Well, basically twice. The first time was technically my fault, I believe. Eh. I'll blame it on 2K20. That's fair. 
Uh, back to the action. There was a big package manager over there by Carnero oh, yeah, de yeah, la yeah. Muerte. It looks like Carnero <laughs> might be taken out. Violento. Oh, Violento has the lead. We're down to Carnero and CJ Glory. CJ Glory, who is hanging out, I believe, outside of the ring. Yeah, he was uh, taking time to himself to, you know, recuperate after some of the brutal violence he's taken in this match. And, you know, I would too. I would too. Maybe take, you know, one or two months after, fair. after some of the moves we've been seeing today. That's a fair, fair assessment. Oh, Panero putting CJ in the corner. Oh, but you were able to move out of the way. Ooh. Oh, big alley oop from CJ Gore. CJ Gore picking him. Picks up Carnero. Ooh. Elbow to the back of the head. Big European uppercut. Goes for a big knee, but misses. In Zaguri from Carnero. Carnero could be setting up something here. It certainly could be. Looks like he's going for a big, big arm drag there. And I think we might here. be in oh, here we go. Uh -oh. it, there it is, a Yoshi Tonic. Code red. And certainly. Oh, but only no. a two. Wow. Went for the drop kick. CJ Glory scouted it. Moved out of the way. CJ certainly given us. Glory. CJ Glory, you know, CJ Glory is no slouch. He was, he was, did make it to the finals of our title tournament last week. I do believe that. Oh, big single it open, leg CJ's code breaker. Face. That could be all. Big move there. No! Fight. CJ Glory with a lot of fight. That might have been a mistake though, going to the outside when you're in the ring with someone like Carnero. Big! Tope there. Eh, that's definitely not uh, somewhere you want to be caught outside of. Anywhere in the nearby vicinity. What is he doing? What? Oh, he might be going for something on the outside here, does Carnero. Onto the concrete. Oh, can we see it? Oh, big spinning DDT there. We caught oh, most of it. Thanks, cameraman. Yeah. Classic cameraman. Throws him into the ring. Looks like he might be setting up for the end. The end may be near. What's he going for here? Looks like it might be that package pile driver again. Could this be enough? Oh, Chicha Gloria is bleeding from the, the right, the left ear, I believe. That is brutal. Oh, indeed. Yeah, it looks like that. he thinks that is enough. We'll see. No! Wow. So much resiliency in CJ Glory. Yes, indeed. CJ Glory just refusing to stay down. Wait, what's this? La Magistral! The La Magistral Cradle. That could be it. It certainly could. Oh no! And it is yeah, not. Glory showing a Another lot of fight. Count. Oh, crucifix pin. Carnero wants this over, it seems. But no, CJ Glory will not stay down. So he's going, oh, whips him off, throws him to the floor. CJ goes up to the top row. A moment. Oh, but CJ Glory able to move out of the way. CJ Glory throws Carnero into the ring. It is certainly anybody's game at this point, folks. Oh! Uh -oh. That big elbow. And CJ Glory looks like CJ Glory thinks that's it. And it might be. That was brutal. That was all and there it wrote. is. CJ Glory with that big knockout elbow. I believe that wow. is Carnero's first. No, not his first loss. I'm mistaken. He did lose by DQ last week because Violento chose to use a chair. He certainly did. Here are some of the replays of that match. Big Kamagoye from CJ Glory there. We thought I thought that was it for Carnero, but Carnero kept fighting. Lots of big blows from CJ Glory. There was. CJ Glory is a brutal the strong man there. He is a good Gloria. Close enough. Yeah. Hey. You know, maybe it is a reason uh, we're being cancelled, you know what I'm saying? Oh, uh, we are incompetent in almost every way. You know, cameraman's kind of suck. Our announcer doesn't know how to pronounce anybody's name. It's it really isn't any wonder that uh, I, I mess we up. Didn't half, get canceled sooner. I mess up half the moves. Who knows? I'm surprised we made it this far. 
does look like we are back to streaming than just you. Well, that's fine. I'm well, glad we had some people for a little while. In there. Hmm? We had a WWE GA Gaming for, oh. for just a moment. No, no, I never saw them, but they were there. They were indeed. Hey, you know what? We had we got four followers today, so I'm happy. Yeah, I'll take it. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take it. Oh, we have a big match here. Joe and the Ape versus Anubis and Death. Oh, Anubis starting off hot. Anubis was not our oh main event goodness. last week, showing a lot of fire. I have to wonder if Anubis is a little insulted that he's back in a tag match after being in the main event last week. You we have, have to some, wonder, indeed. He might have something to prove tonight. We will see. Oh, and there's one of Joe's favorite things to do. Yeah. <laughs> Just Joe, the enemy Joe just loves to it. throw people off and just let them run into him and fall over. Oh, the ref, he took down the ref on accident, I believe. It's like he always oh, tagging in Ape Boy. This match is about to pick up here once Ape Boy's in this ring. Ape Boy, a very entertaining high flyer. Big Hurricane Rana. Oh, Ape Boy to the top rope. Goes for a big drop kick, misses. Nubis goes for a punch, misses. Oh, but hits the second one. Maybe that first one was fake was to fake him out. Oh. Oh, big kick from Anubis Dave Boy. A big kick indeed. Oh, look for a kick there, but missed. Dragon suplex from Ape Boy. But the ref is knocked down, so he's not able to get a pin off of that. No, he is not. Oh, Ape Boy looks like he went after Death, which is questionable, because that Death was able to fight back out of it. Oh my gosh, oh. It's almost across the ring with that dropkick from Anubis. And Anubis says, I think that might just be Anubis, enough. How about Shuffle Hand rolling him over? I think he might be knocked out cold. No, wait! Wow. He's still got some fire left in him, does Ape Boy. Oh, big and punch. And there it is. Oh! Uh oh Caught with the super kick. Goes for a pin of his own, he thinks that might be it. That knockout super kick, but no. Lucas says, I've, I've taken worse. And I'm certainly not taken out that easily. Oh, elbow from Ape Boy. Looks like he might have took out his legs there, did Joe. Sent him flying there. there. What is he going for here? Oh my! Oh. Gut wrench fall away slam across the ring from Joe. Joe whips off Anubis. Oh, didn't knock him down that time. Anubis showing some fire here. Joe throws him off. It's like he's telling him to fall down when I throw you. Takes out death for good measure. Joe is just like he's a, literally a gorilla. I mean, he is a beast in there. Oh my! Goodness gracious! Gorilla press into a spine buster. It's like Joe might have injured his arm though. Punches out death. Elbows Anubis. Goes for a punch but misses. Elbow from Anubis. Palm strike. Suplex. Great combination there from Anubis. Anubis goes to the top rope. He's jumping off with a big elbow drop, but misses. Joe able to get up. Oh, throws him off. Throws him out of the ring. Oh, takes an elbow for his time. I don't know what Anubis is going for there. Looks like he's too far away to hit whatever he's going for there. Yeah, I think he just might be right. What is this? Oh. Looks like he was going for a big powerbomb, maybe, but Anubis is able to fight out of it. Yeah, and he uh, appears oh! to have gotten... Kick to his face. They are just dissecting Anubis here, Joe and Joe and Joe and Ape. They are not letting uh -oh. him tag into death. Go for a double team move. Ooh, trying to take out his arm. Oh, Dragon Suplex again. This time the ref is not knocked down. He might be able to get a pin off of this. But no! Death having none of it. 
Death saving his tag partner. At all. Oh, looks like I can't. Looks like Anubis might have got the best of that. Oh, big flying leg lariat. Oh, what's this? Neck breaker. Oh, what's this? Irish rip him off into the corner. Big flying drop kick. Goes up to the top rope. Hits a drop kick. Looks like he tags out, tagging out to Joe. Oh, but wait, oh! Anubis able to make the hot tag to death! Oh! oh goodness. Death <laughs> walked right into the boot of Joe. He certainly did. Oh, and Joe's doing it. it. He's doing the thing. Is he gonna hit all four ropes? That looks like he might be trying to. Oh no, but Death fighting out of it. Death not taking that kind of insulting move. It looks like Death tried to hit A Boy, but A Boy sucks. Tell me, move it out of the way. Oh, A Boy fighting out. Oh, A Boy. Looks like, oh, what's A Boy doing here? A oh, burning hammer on the floor! I have to question Absolutely if it was a good move there for Death to go after A-Boy. It seemed like a bad decision. Should have just focused on trying to take out Joe. It just certainly seems like that was a bad decision on oh Death's part. Oh my goodness, that right hand! And as we are both very well aware of, Death is no stranger to poor decisions. Oh my gosh! He is just brutalizing him and picking him up after each one. This is... He's literally okay. Death showing some fight, but uh, Joe is is a literal gorilla. It's gonna take a lot more to take Joe down. Eh, yeah, you are certainly not wrong about that. Goes for that big punch again, but Death able to fight out of it. Joe tagging out to uh, Ape Boy. Oh. Oh, handspring into a Inziguri. It's like uh, a boy is working over the arm. Oh, he was fighting back there with a big elbow to a boy. Oh, big single leg drop kick from a boy. A boy whips death into his into. Ape Boy in Joe's corner goes for a tag here. Looks like they're setting up uh -oh. for a tag move. Double snap, Marion to double kicks. And wait, what's this? Oh, an assisted sent on there. Oh, and there's that punch again. This is just. This is a lot more one sided than I was expecting, I'll be honest. Anubis and Death, they're not they're not going out easy, but they are not getting as much offense as I was hoping for in this match. In a match against a literal gorilla. Because it turns out it is just a very hard match to that win is, at all. That is true. Oh, and there's that big punch again. I think he thinks that's it. We will see. No! That says no. Uh, Death no, sits right up. Oh, what's this? Big back suplex. Looks like Death was hoping for a tag there, but Anubis was nowhere to be seen. No, he was not. Oh, but a big oh, flying elbow from Death. Just taunting right in the face of Ape Boy. Oh, Ape Boy. It got into Ape Boy's head, it seems. Well, what's this? Oh, I can't tell. Looks like he's just pulling him around. I don't know. Oh, and oh, this could be it. That's the gorilla press into the Michinoku driver. That that could be all she wrote for death. Could be. Has death finally de died himself? No. No, he is not. <laughs> wow. Certainly was not expecting that, folks. 
Oh, what's uh -oh. this? A roar! Out of, out of the ape, and he's glowing red. I don't know what's going on. Oh my goodness! Oh, he's going for looks like a choke slam, but no, reversed. Oh, big paw to the back of the head. Anubis keeps reversing this, but oh, Joe was persistent. Yes, he was. Joe whips death into his corner. Looks like he is going for some sort of no. It looks like he was going for a tag move, but it did not matter. Death fighting out of it. Death showing a lot of heart for the literal god of death himself. Oh, death takes down Ape Boy. Oh, takes Does down Ape Boy again. So he's going after Joe. Questionable decision, but no, it pays off. Oh, Death fighting back. Death showing some fire here. Some real fire. Oh, and wait, no, that's the Tombstone double knees, isn't it? That could oh, be it. Indeed. I don't know, that might be on the road. Oh my! Oh my gosh! <laughs> Death showing so much fire. Going for that burning. And it turns out it may not be. Go for that burning hammer anything. again. Oh, and oh, they're on the ropes. Oh my Joe god. Joe takes out Anubis. Oh, and there's that super kick. Oh! The back and forth action. Looks like Ape Boy might have hurt his arm there, I can't tell. All to the head! This just turned into an all-out brawl here. What it oh my. We've never seen Joe come off the top row. Oh my! King Kong knee drop! Wow. What a match, folks. What's what's Ape Boy doing here? Hurricane Rana! Oh! Reversed! Oh, but wow. Ape Boy able to kick out of it. Oh! Crucifix pin! But they're right next to Anubis. Anubis will definitely be able to break this up. And he does. Big jumping drop kick. Ape Boy takes down Anubis, calls for a comeback. Oh, telling him he's gonna hit him. Oh, throws him down. Big senton. Oh, and uh -oh. didn't tell me what to press in reverse. It cool. And now it's stuck on the screen. Love this game. Oh, uh, back to calling the action. Uh, my microphone yeah. must have cut off. I was, yep, that's what happened. That, that will I wasn't. On I was not sitting, stewing in anger due to how bad this game is. Definitely not that. Definitely not that. Oh, close on to the back of the head by death. Brawling outside here. Well, looks like he's going for something out there, but first. Versus of his own, maybe? No, suplex on the floor. They only have a 10 count. They need to get back in this ring. They do indeed. Oh, Ape Boy looks like he's trying to throw him in. He did. He gets in himself. And we're back in. And oh, what's this? Tombstone, double knees. Boom. Oh, but Anubis was ready for that. 
Oh, Death getting out. And for what? It looks like, I don't know. Oh, an elbow, apparently. Right into the arms of Death. Oh, my. That's a, that's a tiger suplex. Joe must have learned that in the jungle. There's tigers in the jungle, right? Hey. All right. Oh, there was the Joe spot. Joe's getting out of the ring. The ref is counting him. He is indeed. Oh. Reversal there. From death. Oh. Hot tag from Anubis. Uh, from, from Ape Boy to Joe. Oh. Big paw to the face. Big punch to the head. Joe is just a house of fire right now. Oh, what's this? Gonna be going for a power bomb. And he delivers. Wow. Certainly, that must be it. And this could oh, this could be the gorilla press into the Michinoku. That and there it is, is probably all she wrote. Anubis is not able to make the save right now. And that is and a Joe is. and the Ape with the big win tonight. And a very hard-fought back-and-forth match. A lot of action. Great match there. Very excited about that one. Yep, there yep, they are. There they are. The winners. <laughs> the winners. Our next match, we have the Macho Meat Men of Macho Man's Ghost and Ribby taking on the Dynamite Brothers, David and Elias Dynamite. This is a fan favorite team in the Macho Meat Men going up against quite possibly the most hated team in the company of the Dynamite Brothers. Yes, indeed. This is uh this match has a lot on the state. I'd say it had a lot on the lines, but it really it doesn't because it's the last show and win or lose, yeah. they're both teams are getting fired. That's right. <laughs> uh, I just got where that match got canceled. Oh, that sucks. Oh, Sorry, uh, fans. Crazy. Sorry oh. about that guy. Weird. Wait. Okay. Sure. I guess I'll be Joy Muscles. Oh, that wasn't the plan. Okay. No, I'm not. Okay. <laughs> I thought I had Joey Muscle selected. Well, hopefully Joey Muscle shows up. It looks like there might be a dark void instead of nothingness. This is why <laughs> this will be the last week of Overkill. Oh, look, there they are. There is Rick Anderson and Joey Muscles. Oh, oh Joey Muscle is starting up hot here. Taking starting the fight to Rick strong. Anderson. Oh, but Rick Anderson fighting out of this. As much as I love Joy Muscles, you have to think on paper this is a match that is a guaranteed win for Rick Anderson. Joy Muscles never won a match. Rick, Anderson, right. Rick Anderson only lost one to a very talented competitor in Anubis. Not that Joy Muscles isn't talented, but just he has not shown the ability to win a match yet. Not quite yet. And this is the final show, so if he doesn't do it tonight, he may never get a chance to do it. Oh, big clothesline from Joey Muscles. Joey Muscles just coming in hot. Yes, oh, he going is. for a moonsault. And oh, oh my gosh! That look. Rick Anderson's body brutal. went limp there. I'm worried. I don't know if he could even stop that if he wanted to. Rick Anderson big might be out cold. Hey, Joey Muscles says no. I wait, Rick Anderson is not. Nick, no, don't count Rick Anderson out yet. I thought he might have been out cold, but it looks like he is getting some feeling back. Oh my! Oh, oh big God. elbow. Joey Muscles is just taking it to Rick. Perhaps he's got some pent up aggression against the against Rick from that first that is, from that first match. I can and understand the, the beatdown that. that he gave him afterwards. That is true. Rick Anderson is what we like to call in the industry a sore winner, which you know you don't see often, but 
Even after uh -oh. he wins, he still wants to hurt people. Dragon screw leg whip. Whips him off. Oh! Took his head off of that lariat. Yeah, he did. Yeah, he did. Another clothesline. Just working the head and the neck here. Makes sense. Setting up for that big pile driver he likes to hit. Oh, there's that patented Rick Anderson shoulder tackle. Throws him off again. Drop down. Drop down. Shoulder tackle. Rick Anderson is starting to get back in the swing of things. Doing what only Rick Anderson knows how to do, which is just wrestle that old school style that not a lot of people do anymore. Big right. running knee strike. He is just taking it to Joey. Oh! Oh, goodness. Big knee. Rick Anderson thinks that's enough. I doubt it. There's a lot of fire in that Joey Muscles. And there it is, that classic Joey Fire Muscles. Joey Muscles Fire, even. That makes a little more sense. It does make... That's the oh, video. my! Big flying... Uh, Crossbody. Oh! Oh, he's going for that deadlift powerbomb again. Could be all she wrote. It could be. But no, Rick Anderson. Unlikely. Able to fight out of it. Looks like Rick Anderson might be fighting out of this. Oh! Big knee Andy. strike. What could he be going for here? My friend, that spine muscle would cut into a big DDT there by Joy Muscles. Oh! What's this? Gut wrench? Oh my! Pump handle, even oh. not gut wrench. Pump handle my into goodness. a face buster. That was crazy. Oh! And it goes for that spine buster again, but again, Joy Muscles has scouted. Wow. What happens when you have a move that's your signature move? A lot of times it is easy to scout. Oh, but there, oh, he grabbed him weirdly and like threw his head down. That was, that was one of the most brutal spine busters I've ever seen. I have to agree with you there, my friend. Oh, he normally likes to do the spinning pile driver after the spine buster, but Joey Muscle's fighting back and not letting him get a chance. That's right. Don't know what Joey's quite doing there. Maybe that spine buster really rocked his head because that made no sense. That might have been the case. We might need to give him a concussion check after this. Again. What in the world is going on with Joey? Oh, there's that shoulder tackle. Classic. That is. Classic that is classic Rick Anderson. What is Rick Anderson doing here? Just toying with him. Oh, goes for a German. Nope. Reversed. Oh, big back suplex. There it is. Repeated kicks. Look for an elbow. Reverse to do an elbow. Oh, walks away from the big flying elbow from Joey. Yes, he does. Tells him to get up. What? Is, oh, he's just... Uh -oh. And he's taunting. He's he's not going to give these fans a high-risk move. That's not in his style. Oh, he is not. Oh. What is going... Questionable decision to fall him out there like that. Oh, but back and forth chop battle. Oh, what's this? Oh! Big knee lift. Try to take Joey Muscle's head off of that one. Oh, it's the spinning pile driver. He has won so many matches with that one. 
Así es. Oh my goodness. Joy Muscles kicked out. Yeah, that's definitely what happened. Totally. I saw, I saw the kick out animation. Joy Muscles showing fire here. Will not die. Oh, he will not. Oh, big inverted DDT. Scorpion this fight just getting obliterated by Rick at this point. Not really putting any moves in against them. Oh, the big flying oh. crossbody. This time he's nice able to do, do it in the right direction. Goes for a suplex. A reverse. Catches a knee to the head. Whips him off. Oh! Drop down! Punches to the head. Wow. Oh! Big flying crossbody! Cross oh, and there's that shoulder tackle. I really just don't think there's a way for Joey Musters to win this one. I've I would be, be shocked on as much oh, as I would love to he, see it. He oh. reversed the spine buster. And it looks like he might have busted open Rick Anderson. Oh, kick to the face. If he didn't before, he will now. Deadlift. Into a power on the third one of the night. It doesn't go for the bin, though. No, he does not. And you got to wonder why. After busting that man's face open, surely. Oh, goes for a chop. Does Rick Anderson... Oh, there's the big crossbody from Joey Muscles. Showing so much fire. He really is. He really is. Oh my! Oh! Throws him out. Just kind of running around, doesn't know what to do. Almost as if the targeting system and his brain is off. If, yeah, sure. Another spinning pile driver! That's gotta be it! What? Wow. How? I don't know how that's possible. So much fire in Joey Muscles. Oh! And a Rick disrespectful Anderson, the slap to the face. Disrespectful slap I've ever seen. But there was a lot of force behind it because that was not a very enthusiastic kick out from Joey. I think Joey is worse for wear right now. He is not doing well. Yeah, I think Another I chop. am inclined to agree. Oh, elbow. Back and forth here. Oh, Joey whips him off. Don't know what he was going for there, but Rick Anderson away. Oh, wait. Dragon screw leg whip. Maybe he was playing possum there. Oh, big Whoa. running elbow. Sets him up for a perfect spot for a diving move. Let's go for that moonsault. Oh my. And into the pin. Oh my gosh. Kicks out before the ref even was able to count to one. That's right. Wow. Oh! Big Michinoku driver. Oh, and there's the slime buster. Wow. Oh, he's telling him to get up for that spinning. Not good news for Joey Muscles. Pile driver. Oh, my. But what? Oh! He, he reversed it! Wow. Oh, so close. Inverted oh, Frankensteiner. Oh that could be all. That's his finish. And ladies and... Joey Muscles won? 
That's and a miracle. In the I, overturn of the ages. That is... I... Wow. Good but for Joey. No one expected. Good for Joey. Here is your winner, man. Wow. Lee Joey. Just wow. I am I am shocked. Should be for the tag titles. It isn't, but it is, okay? Remember it is. Hey. Definitely is. Actually no. That's why. Mm. Actually, yeah, it doesn't matter. <laughs> no, no, that's that's lame when we do that. <laughs> that's true. That'd be a very decisive victory. Yeah. Hopefully, this tag match doesn't get thrown out like the last one. Hopefully, this is kind of one of the more important ones. Tying this one up. All right, we're good so far. That's good. Oh my! Chuckles ran right into that super kick. Pops right up and does a hurricane run though to Max Sava. Oh, just takes Spencer Fireheart down. Whoop! Float over into a neckbreaker from Chuckles. Chuckles tags in Frank the Butcher. Frank the Butcher off the ropes. Goes for something. Reversed into a STO from Max Out. Oh, Chuckles been taken down. Oh my! You know, Mac and that was Fireheart such an impressive suplex. Something to prove here. That is true. Against Frank and Chuckles. Oh, spun out into that Blue Thunder Bomb. This is this is really one-sided. I did not expect that. Oh my! Queen suplex. Oh! Savages taking it to Frank. Oh, and. It appears as though what is going on here? All right. Looks like Frank They're is slicing each other up. Frank says, "Tag out." He has had enough of Savas' beatdown. Oh. Savas says, "Why not? Fire hard. Have some fun." Oh, elbow to the knee. Big flying hurricane around up and chuckles. Oh, Sava kicks chuckles, but. It only rocked oh. him a little bit. He was still able to hit that big elbow on the yes, Christopher was. Fireheart. Quite handily. Oh, Fireheart whips off Frank Chuckles, I mean. What? Uh, okay. Yeah. Very interesting choice by Fireheart here. This match is just falling apart here. That would appear that way. Here at way, my friend. This is a crazy match. Oh, dragon screw leg whip. Oh, gut wrench. Leave into a sit out power bomb. Oh my. Oh, chuckles gets up. Oh, what's he doing here? Snap suplex. Just throws him down. Tags in Frank the Butcher. Hurricane Rana from Christopher Fireheart. Oh, he's pulling in Chuckles for a neckbreaker. Oh! Uh oh! Catches my the goodness. kick! Dragon Screw Leg Whip! Fireheart! Frank says, the Butcher sits right, up, you sits right up into a kick, that is. Goes for a wild blow there, does Frank? He's knocked a little loopy. Oh, caught by Christopher Fireheart! Fireheart showing so much heart. He is showing why he is the heart and soul. Yes. His namesake. Yes. I suppose. Showing why he is the heart and soul of this company. But wait. Oh! Big Good. clothesline. Frank just taking him to town here. Oh, Frank going for that chair. Oh! Went for, looks like he was going for a weapon of some sort. Because he knows if he gets disqualified, he will retain the tag titles. I would hate to see this end that way, but it could... Oh, my! It could indeed. I don't think Frank cares. He more cares about just damaging. 
Oh, but he knocks the ref down. Hits Sava with the ref's wow. down. Ref did not see that. No, he did not. Unfortunate for Sava. Catching a stray chair. Oh, there's that hit. big boot. Big slam. Goodness. He puts that in the corner. And throws Sava into it. Oh! Clothesline from Max Avenue to Christopher Fireheart. And he says, you want to try to target my guy? I'll take out Yoz oh. instead. Hits him. Dragon screw leg with so many of those. They are targeting the leg. Oh my! Into a suicide into dive! A suicide dive. Oh my goodness. Size on the top rope. Size not to be there. Oh, ref's been knocked down again. The ref does seem to be back up. Sava doing a cool flip. Showing off. Showing that he is not worried about Frank the Butcher. Goodness. But, you know, that may have been a mistake. Because he be. Yeah, because Frank the Butcher, he is taking it to Sava right now. I'll throw Sava out of the ring. Oh, goes for an elbow, oh. misses. Oh! oh. Chuckles, I think, went for a slash, but misses as well. Here. This is not going the way they wanted it to, I don't believe. Oh, but throws him into the corner. Picks up that chair again. I'm scared. Yes, yeah, would I. And he charges the ref. Takes the ref down again. I don't know how the ref didn't see that chair shot, but did not call anything. No, he did not. Oh my, just elbowing the ref in the kidneys. Goes for a chair shot. Goes for another one. Oh, takes a chair shot of his own there. Oh, oh! Big face buster. Deadly dive. Oh, wow. Dragon screw leg whip. Oh, Chuckles taken out. Oh! Oh! Back and forth action here. Punch to the gut. Elbow to the back of the head. Goodness. Takedown from Max Ava there. So going away for a suplex, but oh, reversed into a neck breaker by Frank the Butcher. I'm just taking out the ref again. Decides to throw fire hard wow. in the chair instead. Oh, big boot. This match is just brutal. Mm. Big uppercut. Mm. Next time goes to the top rope. Punch to like, the face. Not... Oh, float over. In, oh, win for the DT, but no reverse by Frank the Butcher. Big elbow to the back of the head. Oh! Big flying knee! To Max Eva. Max Eva. Trying to figure out what to do next. Dagon and Fireheart. Oh! They both went for moves, but neither one was able to hit it there. A big running power slam. Fireheart winces in pain there. Understandably so. 
Oh, reverse another dragon screw leg whip. This match has been nothing but dragon screw leg whip to this point. Oh! Oh! Oh, back and forth. Oh! Heads for takeover. Chuckles rolls out of the ring. Oh, gut wrench into that. Sit down, powerbomb. There it is. Oh, my. Oh. Fire going after Chuckles. Oh, goes for another one. I've had enough of your interference in this match. I'm sit delivering out. another sit out power bomb. Power bomb. This one, he goes for the pin on this one. But doesn't even get a one count. Frank the Butcher is not wow. willing to stay down. Frank the Butcher is showing so much fight. You know, I don't like the man. I don't like the way he does things, but he is not a pushover in any capacity. Wow. Oh, what's this? Oh! I don't know if he has a name for that, but that was brutal. It was indeed. Oh, Fireheart fighting back, elbows to the back of the head. Last one caught him good. Throws him out of the ring. Oh, Chuckles pulls him down. Oh, Frank pulling Sava in. It's like he was going for his finisher on him, maybe, but no. Max Sava's fighting back. Oh. Oh. Picks him up. Kreutzrath. German suplex there. Wow. And that certainly could be it, folks. But no. And it's not. Frank the Butcher showing so much fight. So much you almost have to respect him. Not quite. I don't. But you could either respect either said if you did. Wow. Oh. Fire target that neck. He certainly did. Looks like he might be going for that diamond in the rough. And Andy's. And he's hit. It is. There it is. That is the diamond in the rough. Oh no! But the referee has been taken down too. But it looks like Fireheart is going to wait it out. And it might just. But you have to wonder up. if the ref wasn't taken out. That would have been three. But it that gave just enough time for him to be able to fight out of it. Oh, whips him into the corner. Oh, he's setting him on the top rope for something. Goodness gracious, folks. This could be. This could be it. Oh. Fireheart says no. For a rolling elbow and misses. Oh, elbow to the back of the head. Back of the head. Oh, there's that spinning throw he does. Picks him up. Oh, Fireheart fighting out of it. Oh, big back elbow. Oh, hot tag and chuckles. But I didn't know it's a fire. Right ready, rare, they're right, ready to go, beating him up. Oh, big bulldog. Blocks the cutter. Hurricane Rana. Oh, need him in the side of the head. I think he's going for his finisher here. And and he's hit it. But it does look like Christopher Fireheart might be able to make the save. And he does. Oh. Don't know who he's going for there. Attacking Christopher Fireheart on the outside. Oh, whips him into the corner. And leaves him there to take care of Savile.
Oh, Savvy oh. goes for that springboard into a tornado DT, but did not catch him. Chuckles had it scouted. By a mile. Oh my, that big clothesline from Chuckles. Oh! Bangarang! Wow. Spinning back elbow of his own. Oh, what's this? Oh, exploding hammer. Oh. oh. That looks like it might have knocked Chuckles loopy. And understandably so. Oh, and into the cutter. That... That could be it, if he can capitalize here, be. which it looks like he is able to capitalize. it looks like Sam is going in for the pin. Ladies and gentlemen. We have new tag team champions. Ignore there the fact that they're not going to be given the titles. They're the new tag champs. Dava closing it out on Chuckles the Clown. A big knee strike there in that replay. Some back and forth fighting there in that replay. That was the Kreutz Wrath. You yeah, know, you love, you love to see justice be served like this. There's your winners. And new tag champions, Sava and Fireheart. And last tag team champions, for that matter. That's right. Was his shirt always that color? No, it shows the other color. It's a backup shirt he has on, apparently. Oh. Very interesting. And this is for our world title. We have Big Daddy Zach Harris, our challenger, going up against our our champion, uh, that creepy dude, Travis Bateman. Travis Bateman. <laughs> it's no secret that me and Vinny are both rooting for Zach Harris tonight. Oh, no secret at all. Oh, rolling combo kick. That's how he won the title. It certainly is. <laughs> Big Daddy Harris says that's not how you're winning tonight. Oh! Big boot. Kicks him in the shoulder there. Big running kick to the back there. This Travis Bateman man, he is a creepy fellow, but he also really is adept at kicking people in the head. He certainly is. Oh! Big overhead to belly to belly. The ref is down. But it doesn't look like anyone went to, to take advantage of that and cheating in any capacity, which is what you want to see. Oh! Big back elbow from Zach Harris. Oh my! Back elbow! Who is now just delivering? Wraps up his like a knee wonder. breaker. That's smart there, trying to take out Travis Bateman's knees. One of his finishes is a, a shining wizard, which is a running knee strike to the face. Oh my! Oh my goodness! This Zach Harris fellow, I, you know, some people may have questioned how he got a title shot so quickly. He hasn't been in the company that long. I mean, not that the company's been around that long, but he's been here less than some people. And, you know, it's because of moves like this and fire like this. This man is a brutal beast in this ring. He is Big Daddy himself. Yeah, there is a reason they call him Big Daddy. Ooh, big clothesline. Followed up by a boot. He's picking up Travis Bateman. Whips him off. Travis Bateman is on the floor. Oh, big cross body. All his weight good. falling onto Travis Bateman. That is, Zach Harris is not a small man. That would not feel good. Ooh, took his head off with that line. And it looks like, you know, we, we expect a lot of this punishment from the head from Travis Bateman, but Zach says, I know how to deal just exactly that kind of punishment as well. Oh, takes him down. Oh, just palm strikes to the head. Into an arm bar. Oh, and Zach Harris is able to fight out. And deliver oh, a couple punches a few to the head. Punches right to the head. Oh. Belly to belly suplex. Oh, palm strike. Oh, goes for the wrong combo kick, but in the wrong direction. Some of the shots to the head might have knocked Travis a little loopy. Oh, and that's not gonna right. help with that back suplex. 
Saido, actually, not a back suplex. A little bit different. Similar, but not the same. Oh, back fists! Oh, kick to the head from Travis Bateman. Big German oh. right on his head! This is a brutal main event we have here. This is for the title. The, the winner of this match will be the last champion we ever have. Could it be our first champion, Travis Bateman, or will it be Zach Harris taking that title off of him? Oh, Travis went for that dropkick. Zach was able to scout it. Scout it quite capably. Oh, big Russian leg sweep. Went for a kick. Ooh. Catches a kick of his own right in the back. Oh, oh, big knee strike. And Zach says, I'm done with you. But no, Travis Bateman not staying down. Travis Bateman throwing a lot of fire here. And that is what we have unfortunately come to expect of Travis. And what's this? Oh, Travis Bateman reversed that powerbomb into a DDT. Oh, there's that super kick that sets up that shining wizard. Oh! And there it is. Oh, wait. He does not seem to be done with him. He is slunched over. He is primed and ready. Oh! Ripcord capo kick. What is... He's picking him up again. He Fairly probably bad. had the match beat. I don't... Why he's doing this? Went for that super kick again. Setting up a second shining wizard. He busted him open. Oh. I saw it. Oh, my. This, that's it. That's gotta be it. No oh my way! Goodness. Zach Harris showing a lot of fire. Not willing to die. Not at all. Rolling capo kick! That is how he won the title. I don't know if it'll be enough tonight. It might be, though. It was! Wow. That rolling capo kick. Well, I'll let the replay show that it's the first rolling combo kick of the match earlier on. That was the first move of the match. There's that brutal knee strike from Zach Harris. Two different angles of it. Yeah. I mean, it was a, it was a good knee strike. It was strike. a good knee strike, I understand. Oh, there's that power bomb that was reversed into a DDT by our still current champion, Travis Bateman. There's that shining wizard that Almost got it done, but did not quite get it done. There, there's that two count. Here kick out. Did not get a replay of the finish. Bates Travis Bateman. And then is, then is that oh. Bates man. Oh, Travis. Travis, this is the last lasting image people will ever see of us. Why are you? No, please, Travis. Oh, goodness. Oh. Taking it, the fight to him. I don't like to see this. I really don't. Oh my! Just running into the brutalizing to the him, I'll throw him over. Out. throwing him back in the ring, kicking him in the back. Oh, he's picking him up. What can he be going for here? Oh, there's that pop-up kick. He did not get to do it in the match, but he's doing it in the post-match beatdown. Well, oh, there you see the blood on the forehead there of. Zach Harris, he is not able to defend him from up right now. He is really hurt. Oh, and there's that ripcord capo kick. That is the last there image you will ever see here. And that's, oh. I don't know how to feel well, about she that. Wrote. I do well, not. She wrote. Well, this has been Downtown Kentucky Pro Wrestling. Um, wow. That was not how I wanted the last show to end. I'll be honest. Me, Curtis McElroy, I didn't want it to end at all, but it is what it is. Um, I'm happy to announce that I have, you know, secured a new job in sports casting. How about you, Vinny? What are you doing next? Uh, who knows? Oh, <laughs> I was really hoping you'd have something to announce. That's really sad for you. Perhaps um, filing for unemployment. <laughs> oh, oh my gosh. Um, hey. Well, that's a downer. Um, this has been Curtis McElroy and, and Vinny. Same Thank you for, for tuning in. Time. And uh, this is Austin and, and Chris. Uh, yeah. This is us closing Thanks. out. Uh, thank you for tuning in to the last episode. Yeah. Um, as you can see why it was the last episode, that game is a broken mess. But um, yeah, it sure is. if you watched it and you enjoyed it, cool. Thank you. Thanks.
Maybe maybe we'll try again in a better game someday. We'll see. Yeah. Probably not, but maybe. Yeah, in a Who game knows? that works. Yeah. Who knows? Maybe. Thank you for tuning in to the stream. Thank you for tuning in to the video. Bye-bye. So long. <laughs>